Hi guys, it's Bags and President Ross. Today we have an updated election map. Who do you guys want to win? Let us know in the comments. Also, like, subscribe. We are trying to get to 4,000 watch hours and 2,000 subscriptions. We have results from 270towin.com, and let's fill in this map for you according to 270towin.com's electoral map. Washington State with 12 electoral votes is blue for Kamala Harris. Oregon with 8 electoral votes is blue for Kamala Harris. California with 54 electoral votes is blue for Kamala Harris. Hawaii with 4 electoral votes is blue for Kamala Harris. Alaska with 3 electoral votes is red for Donald J. Trump. Montana with 4 electoral votes is red for Donald J. Trump. Idaho with 4 electoral votes is red for Donald J. Trump. Wyoming with 3 electoral votes is red for Donald J. Trump. Nevada with six electoral votes is a light pink for Donald J. Trump. Here lately, it has been a flip-flop between gray, blue, and heavy red in Nevada. But as of right now, it's a light pink again. It's been a battleground state. It's wild. Utah, however, and a shocking turn of events is now heavy blue for Kamala Harris. The Mormons must have changed sides or something, or Mitt Romney, who knows? So this is quite shocking according to 270towin.com. Utah has never been blue in any of our past election map videos, but we're going to keep it for 270towin's sake and integrity. Colorado with 10 electoral votes is blue for Kamala Harris. New Mexico is a light blue with 5 electoral votes for Kamala Harris. Arizona with 11 electoral votes isn't colored in on 270win.com. It's a battleground state. It's been flip-flopping, a swing state, whatever you want to call it. North Dakota with 3 electoral votes is red for Donald J. Trump. South Dakota with three electoral votes is red for Donald J. Trump. Nevada with four electoral votes is red for Donald J. Trump. And its first district is red for Donald J. Trump. And the tiniest district is blue on 271.com. That's a shakeup from earlier's video and last night's video as well. So, Kansas with six electoral votes is red for Donald J. Trump. Oklahoma with seven electoral votes is red for Donald J. Trump. Texas is a light pink with its 40 electoral votes. It's probably going to flip to Donald J. Trump like it usually does. Minnesota is a light blue with 10 electoral votes for Kamala Harris. Uh, Wisconsin with 10 electoral votes and Michigan with 15 electoral votes are gray. They both will not be colored in for this whole video. They are battleground states according to 270win.com. There is no lead leading to the red for Donald J. Trump or the blue for Kamala Harris in either state, which is a toss-up on other websites, polls, and maps that we have referenced in the past. Iowa with six electoral votes is red for Donald J. Trump with a little pink. One more click on it for Iowa. And Missouri with 10 electoral votes is red for Donald J. Trump. Arkansas with 6 electoral votes is red for Donald J. Trump. Louisiana with 8 electoral votes is red for Donald J. Trump. Illinois with 19 electoral votes. Who knows how they have that many electoral votes when everyone's dying on the weekends in Chicago is blue for Kamala Harris. Now, Indiana with 11 electoral votes is red for Donald J. Trump. Ohio with 17 electoral votes is light pink two clicks for Donald J. Trump. West Virginia with four electoral votes is red for Donald J. Trump. Kentucky with eight electoral votes is red for Donald J. Trump. Tennessee with 11 electoral votes is red for Donald J. Trump. Mississippi with six electoral votes is red for Donald J. Trump. Alabama with nine electoral votes is red for Donald J. Trump. Florida with 30 electoral votes is a light pink two clicks for Donald J. Trump of Republicans. Georgia with 16 electoral votes according to 270win.com is not colored in. It is gray as our kitten. South Carolina with 9 electoral votes is red for Donald J. Trump. And North Carolina with 16 electoral votes according to 272win.com is gray will not be colored in. Virginia with 13 electoral votes is a light blue. Two clicks for Kamala Harris and the Democrats. Pennsylvania with 19 electoral votes is gray. It doesn't sway either or, left or right, Democrat or Republican, Donald Trump or Kamala Harris. It will not be colored in. We are going to fill in the rest, and they are all blue for Kamala Harris, except for one district of Maine. So fill them all in. New Hampshire, Connecticut, New Jersey, Delaware, Massachusetts, Rhode Island. Whoo! Are all blue for Kamala Harris, as well as New York with its 28 electoral votes. Also, we're going to try and figure this out. Maine, with its one electoral vote, is one district is red for Donald J. Trump. 
Only one district is red for Donald J. Trump. The rest are blue, the other two. Fill those in. So that gives Kamala Harris the lead at 232 electoral votes to Donald Trump's 217. This race is so tight, I can feel it like a virgin. Baby, who do you want to win? Trump. And why? To make America great. And I'm President Ross. And I'm Bags. And we are... Out.